remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? Kanye West says he's going to run for president in 2020. He said it first several years ago, and he reiterated it back in November of last year. He said it to a crowd, let's say a jovial crowd, who really thought that he was just being funny. You know why they thought he was being funny? Because he is a bona fide clown. So you know how anytime like a clown shows up, you just want to start laughing just because he's dressed like a clown. So you just want to laugh. And so people started laughing because they don't think this guy could possibly be serious because Kanye West is pretty much a mental case. First he's this, then he's that, then he says this, then he says that, then he takes this back, then he says this, and he's serious, then he just want to all get along. So the dude, remember, this is the same guy who thought about changing his name to Christian Genius Billionaire Kanye West. That's when he had his Christian awakening. He wants to change his name to Christian Billionaire with Christian Genius Billionaire Kanye West. Me, Kanye, do you have any experience that would qualify you to lead the United States of America and the free world. No, but I once stayed at a Holiday Inn. <laughs> I wouldn't put Kanye West in charge of third grade recess, let alone a country, but the people who follow him would for a couple of reasons. One, they love his racist antics. He represents them, how they feel, Make America great again. Two, they are part of the very few elite. And he's making moves to help them get richer. Are y'all people who thought your life was going to be better? You thought your financial situation was going to be better because a rich man was getting into office? <laughs> How is that working out for you? Now, yeah, I know a few of y'all are doing a little better, but that ain't got nothing to do with Trump. It would have happened anyway. Most of you are still suffering, as you should. That's what you get. The fact that Kanye West is threatening to run for president and his baby daddy, Donald Trump, is in the Oval Office is all the more reason that every single presidential candidate should be required to take a mental examination first. We don't need any more crazies running around the White House with the codes to the nuclear room. This just in. Big Bird is also running and he has an early lead over Kanye West. <laughs> man, this is sad, man. This is very, very sad. What we should do is make the presidency a lottery. Every single person over 21 years old qualifies. With that type of system in place, perhaps we'll get lucky and find somebody who knows what the hell they're doing. No more talk. What the talking about?